guys and welcome to another Annabelle's Appetizers video. So before we looked at lychee, lychee tea um, with smoothies, we're going to look at some more smoothies today. Uh, I thought I'd show you the book that I have been using. It's called Carbs and Cows Smoothies. I like this book because it helps with dieting because it breaks down all the calories into grams um, and everything um, for smaller glasses, medium glasses and larger glasses. Um, and it tells you how much protein you're getting in each one, how much fiber. Um, I just find it great. And, and some of them, you know, it, it specifically says it's for your fiber day, you know, if you struggle to get them in. So what are we going to do today? I think the first one we're going to do is probably going to be the most basic out of the two that we are doing in this video. Pineapple cooler. Okay. I'm going to grab my, my grab the bottle. It is as simple as frozen pineapple and coconut water. I like to add in a bit of ice anyway. So uh, we're gonna add in our coconut water. So we've got 240 milliliters of coconut water or coconut drink. We tend to have it, you know, in our supermarkets because it's kind of like milk, isn't it? But, and then our pineapple. I'm gonna add a, a few cubes of ice. got 100 grams of frozen pineapple so I'm gonna just plop them in perfect okay so I've got my blending top here I'll screw that on and it's a, a bit of a shake give it another shake I think that looks like a real good smoothie Give it a shake and I'm just gonna get it another blend. Anyways, I think I'm happy with that, so let's uh, pour it in some into a glass and give it a try. It smells gorgeous. Mmm, nice, so refreshing. It's really good. Mmm, yummy. Right, so that is the uh, cocoa pineapple cooler. So, uh, I, you know, you give it a go and let me know what you think in the comments or on my Facebook page, Annabelle's Appetizers. We're going to try the Choco Orange Date. So, let's give this a try. So, I'm going to grab my uh, blender bottle, my second one, because the other coconut one now is in the fridge, keeping it uh, nice and cool. And the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to add in the milk. So we've got 100 mils of semi-skimmed milk. I'll pour that in there. Now, I'm thinking there's quite a lot of mix of things to add in in this one. Uh, so I'm thinking I'm going to add in my cocoa powder next. So it says one teaspoon. I'm going to go for a nice big heaped one considering that my daughter loves chocolate. No, I'm going to add a teensy bit more actually. So, uh, and I know she'll want to try this one. <laughs> so, I'm just going to give that a little swish. And then I'm just going to add a few ice cubes. So I'm going to go one, two, uh, three. So. Let's give this a mix first with the ice to see how we go in. So I can still hear a bit of the uh, ice in there. But uh, next I'm gonna add in the orange. Now, I've got one sixth of an orange. And just what I'm gonna do is, before I put it in, I'm gonna chop it up into smaller pieces just to make it a bit easier for my blender. Just a few. This, these, this was peeled, so you can see a bit of the white. Um, before I cut it into kind of six pieces to try and just find that one sixth. So I've added in the orange, so let's try and give that a blend now. This makes a small glass, whereas I believe the cocoa pineapple one was meant to give you a medium right. glass. And the last ingredient is the dates. Now it said two dates, 
Um, I don't tend to buy full dates, I tend to buy chop dates. So I worked out that two dates, because they're quite big, are about 48 grams. So I'm going to chop in, up, shove in my chopped dates. And you know what? I'm going to add in just a teensy bit more ice. Because uh, it's looking rather not much in there at the moment. So just a little bit more ice. And let's give that a whir. I hear quite a lot going on in there. I'm just going to give it a bit of a shake. So let's pour some of this into a glass and give it a test. Smells really chocolatey. Oh, look at that. Give it a try. Mmm. Tastes a bit like chocolate milk. Can't really taste much of the orange. Maybe I would have put a bit more orange in um, just to give it that more orange flavour because that does taste chocolatey. But then I did add in a little bit extra chocolate, so maybe that's why. Okay, so let's just go through what we've done. So the chocolate orange date we've just done, that's a small glass. And that says it's one and a half of your five a day. And it's 150 calories for that whole amount there. So the black glass and this. Okay, and then let's go back to the cocoa pineapple cooler. So that, it was literally pine, pineapple and coconut water. Um, so that was only 95 calories for a full medium glass and that's one of your five a day okay maybe it will you'll want to go and buy your own book to give them a try or you can just use the recipes as I put them up um, this I got on Amazon uh, but you could probably find it in a, in a local bookstore as well um, or just search online but um, yeah it, it's really great I'll, I'll post the recipes uh, underneath and um, put all like the fiber intakes and everything like that for you as well, guys. And I hope you enjoy them anyway and uh, give them a try. Put a comment below, go to my Facebook page. And I will be uploading a new video tomorrow, which will be totally different, no smoothies. Um, and I hope to see you all there. Thank you, bye.